All right, everybody, I'm here with Chris from Vegan Zombie. I know it's Memorial Day weekend and your vegans are stressing at these barbecues. I mean, what should these kids do? You know, if you have a big plate of nachos, that would be the ideal thing for Memorial Day. But all these people are lighting their grills. They're like all manly with their charcoal. Like how can we as vegans like take it up a notch? Well, there's only one way to do that. And you're going to need a blowtorch. Do you have a blowtorch? I have a flamethrower. Would that Close work? Close enough. Everybody's got one of those, right? Actually, that's even better than a blowtorch. Should I get one? So we're gonna make flamethrower nachos. And not only will it make the perfect nachos, it'll keep the zombies away. Let's All right, it. let's make some nachos. You guys are making some nachos. What do you think about flamethrower nachos? I think Between Chris and I, we have about 40 years of vegan experience between us. That's right. And vegan cheese has been pretty much horrible for the last 19. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, you can either get cheese that tastes like cardboard or just do without or make your own. That never melted. Never. And that's kind of where this whole flamethrower idea came with. Because I remember I would make like a vegan pizza and I'd grate this block of vegan cheddar and like it, it would be like an hour in the oven it would never melt you like put it under the burner trying to get it to melt and it would never melt i think the first good vegan cheese i had were those tofuti singles <laughs> and they were all right and i would cut them up and i throw them on the pizza and melt them and then later and then, then you put it in the microwave one more time to get it to yeah <laughs> but what we, we got some advanced technology here we got daya and we got some uh miyoko's it's a really, really good cheese. It's uh, um, cashew based. We got some Follow Your Heart Vegan Sour Cream. We got some Upton's Chorizo. What kind of chips do we got here? We got some uh, Bean Fields. Now Bean Fields is gluten free uh, rice bean chip. So let's maybe do one with the white bean and we'll do one with this jalapeno nacho. So we take some real safety precautions here. We got some aluminum line trays that we're gonna do this in. Let's throw them right all over there. We gotta do it fast because the zombies might be coming. I'm gonna use nacho flavored nachos. All right, there you go. So let's get some cheese on this. They melt pretty nicely. And I'm gonna use these uh, chunks of Miyoko's cheese and just kind of throw it in there like that in between. Cheddar makes it all better as long as it's vegan. Tomatoes. All right, let's get everything that's flammable like out of the way. Don't do this at home. Yeah, little safety message. We're grown ass adults and you should not be doing this even if you are grown ass adults. Uh, we got a fire barrier here. Everything's wrapped in foil. We got a fireman off camera ready to come in with a fire extinguisher. I gotta watch He's the kid. Hey, it's I cannot believe that worked. Look at that melty ass cheese. I got it bubbling. Flamethrower nachos. <laughs> I cannot believe that worked, man. I know. We got two trays of nachos. Look at it, it's like melty, melty cheese. All from a flamethrower. All right, See? we're gonna throw some more shit on here. We're gonna try to make these a little Instagram worthy. A little tomatoes. Watch this. Boom, boom. The sour cream on that. Bam. Oh man, look at that. There you are, make your Memorial Day badass with some flamethrower nachos. Make sure to check out our other chaos with this flamethrower on the Vegan Zombies channel. We're gonna make some s'mores. Mm. Oh wow. It's so hard to be vegan these days, right? What's going on? Nachos. Oh, it. You heard about the nacho party. I heard that these are flame thrown nachos. But I wasn't quite sure what that meant. I mean, huh. it's a flame thrown. <laughs> I never liked using the microwave anyways. Yeah, the microwave's like super toxic and this is like more natural. Yeah. yeah. 
and it's fun. This is like how the caveman made their nachos. <laughs> this is this is paleo. Paleo vegan nachos. <laughs> Do it. Paleo and vegan. This is really damn good. Thank you, Beanfields. Yeah, thanks, Beanfields, for working us up. Shout with the out chips. to Beanfields. <laughs>